Hello everyone, this is World Exposure. I don't know how many of you already know this, but this past Thursday, physicist and mathematician Stephen Hawking stated that God did not create the universe. He actually says that the universe created itself out of nothing. In his new book called The Grand Design, Hawking says that the Big Bang was created by the laws of physics as an inevitable consequence. This is all based upon Hawking's theory now that there were multiple universes before ours for the laws of physics to have existed to create our universe. Now Hawking has admitted before that this is just a theory and that that theory has never been backed up by evidence from science. Now, in Hawking's new book, he made statements like this. Because there is a law such as gravity, the universe can and will create itself from nothing. He also says, spontaneous creation is the reason there is something rather than nothing, why the universe exists, why we exist. And he also says, it is not necessary to invoke God to light the blue touch paper and set the universe going. Now, I'm sure atheists all over the world are as giddy as ever about all this, but Hawking still never denies the existence of God. And I'm no expert to any of this, but when Stephen Hawking tries to explain how the universe created itself out of nothing, it doesn't sound like it created itself out of nothing to me. He talks a lot about the laws of physics and other universes. Now, certainly we can't call any of that nothing. I mean, who created all of that? How can you say that all of that is what allowed our universe to spontaneously create itself out of nothing? It just doesn't make any sense. But then again, this is the same guy that in this past year has also taken the time to explain to us what we should do if we are invaded by aliens. Anyway, I have Stephen Hawking's book, A Briefer History of Time, in which Hawking talks a lot about God. In the conclusion, he even concludes by saying that if we ever find an answer to why we exist in the universe, then we would know the mind of God. I'm going to conclude by saying that science never could and never will prove or disprove God since God is a spiritual being, not a scientific being. Therefore, you think scientists of all people would be smart enough to understand that they will never be able to say for certain what roles God has or does not have with the universe.